Welcome inside the Lander Center, where it's a game night here tonight in Mississippi. I'm Lucas Havali, and tonight, for the second straight night, the Mississippi River Kings host the Fayetteville Fire Ants. Last night, the River Kings came out with a 5-3 win over Fayetteville. They overcame three one-goal deficits. After a five-goal first period combined between the two teams, River Kings scored the final three goals over periods two and three. Justin Gavora playing at his first game since late November tied the game at three in the second period. A few minutes after that, Brian Palazzo scored the River Kings first shorthanded goal of the season, gave the River Kings a 4-3 lead and then turned into the eventual game winning goal. River Kings went on to the 5-3 victory and got the first win in the first of five matchups between Fayetteville this season. A couple of players are on a roll for Mississippi since Sunday. In two games, Devin Mantha has five points, two goals and three assists. Meanwhile, Reed Campbell has back-to-back multi-point games. His first two is a pro, and he's got four assists since Sunday. With the win, the River Kings leapfrog Fayetteville in the standings. They're up to sixth place now with 30 points in the back to 500 with 14 wins and 14 losses. Meanwhile, Fayetteville, who does have two games in hand on the River Kings, are a point behind with 29 points on the season. The two top scorers for Fayetteville both had an assist last night. John Kulo with one assist is up to 23 points on the year now for the Fire Ants. Meanwhile, Jan Safar also had an assist. He's got 19 of those on the year. He's got 21 points in total, which leads all scoring defensemen in the SPHL. It's 90s night here at the Lander Center. Those born in the 90s get half price tickets, and if you're in your 90s, you get in for free. Once again, it's the Mississippi River Kings and the Fayetteville Fire Ants here tonight at the Lander Center.